Hey everyone, Shabby here, and welcome back to some more Final Fantasy XII. Right. I've done a bit of research into this, and I'm confused because I'm pretty sure I did it right. You've literally got to press these from left to right in order, but I think what I might have done wrong was in here. So if we press the black sigil, which is what we pressed first last time, it took us to a part of the map. This part, okay. So we need to continue through. And we need to... Right, I think what we did is we might have mistake, we might have made one mistake on this way, okay? So I think we did see it. We went into a room that had some treasure. And I'm annoyed because there's a very good chance of getting a really good weapon that we didn't get. Um, but yeah, we found the secret pathway, didn't we? There's another chest here, okay. Next potion, okay. So yeah, we found this, we came out, we pressed, okay, what we wanted to press was this green one. We need more treasures spawned in here. No, okay, so we should have gone to green, but we went out the other s Fran, did you actually walk on that freaking trap? Okay, so we wanted to press green next, what we should have done, and that should take us to the next area. It does, there we go, okay. This is better. Right, um... Someone's gonna set up. White robes. Oh, sorry, I hope you can't hear that in the background. Um, next door's um, alarm is going off and it hasn't stopped in about an hour. Right, so you have a black mask and white robes then for Pinello. She's doing well out of this um, little journey, isn't she? Um, so this is a... Why? They need to... Oh. Just they need to do something because this is just stupid. Like you avoid the traps and they just go straight through them. Right, so next we're looking for... These are all fake walls, aren't they? I don't know where I'm going here, but I'm literally just breaking all these down. I mean, this feels to me like where they'd hide treasure. Why? Yeah, you're using Libra now, aren't you? A bit late for that now, isn't it? Alright, and um, there's a, actually a treasure chest right at the back of the room we didn't check. Ardor. Is that a weapon? That alarm is so bloody loud. I do apologize if you can't hear it. Um, no, it's not. So what the hell is an R door? Oh, thank God for that alarm's gone off. We had this earlier. We picked some up and I couldn't find it. We had a flare, didn't we, last episode? Now I've got an R door. I don't know what an R door is either. Okay, well, screw it. I'm sure it'll come in handy at some point. Right, so... Okay, so that brings us out to here. Okay, so it was red, green. No, sorry, it was black, green. Now I think it's red. Um, it is actually what it is, right? And I, I figured this out, and I just, for some reason I struggled to keep it, but based on what it needs to be, it was red, green. Uh, and basically, it, it's the way that we did it earlier on. You know when we were doing the, the orbs earlier on in the previous area? It's the same as that, essentially. We still have the map. We don't have the map. We need to fail once to get the map still. It doesn't matter. I don't care about the map. I'd rather not fail. Right, so it's red. Next, I believe. Touch a device. To bring us to the next area, it does. There's an orange one there as well. And it's just to get the chest. I'm dragging them on these bad boys now, aren't I? Yeah. Um, right, no, Ash is doing okay. Ash has got thunder. I feel like I need to take out Varn, though, to be honest, and bring in Bafia. But Varn is the lure, so actually, it's probably not too bad. 
So Fran and Ash are doing the damage. While Van is just... Well, they should be doing the damage. There we go. Ash is doing Thunder now. Ash, could you do Thundara? Them both in one. Um, Thundaga. Yeah. Get them both. There we go. Oh, was high damage that was. Nice, alright. Uh, right, let's get the chest. An Ultima Blade. That sounds amazing. Um, that sounds like a really good weapon. Oh, two ha Oh, is that that good, actually? 109 damage. It's a big upgrade. It is a big upgrade, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. 17 upgrade for Barsh. That is huge. This place is amazing for weapons. Loving it. Right, and then this is the last one. The Sigil of Sacrifice. The last one to press. So that now should take us to the next area once again. It has not. It's brought us to here. Okay. Or is this just what we needed to do? Have I messed this up? I managed to get the map at least. I'm confused. I thought we did that right. So we're okay at the moment because we just need to survive here now until the map pops up again. Saying that we're okay. It was worth coming here just to get the map, I suppose. I mean, there we go. Doors are faded and the magic. Do we just want to sit here and, like, l take advantage for a moment? I mean, let's open the door. Because we can. Actually, no, probably not. Because we don't want to take too much damage. Right, let's flee, people. Let's flee. Let's get out of here. Is that wrong, then? We did that wrong. I'm confused. I thought we did that right. I thought it was right. Yeah. I'll kill this guy. He's gonna harass him. Vanilla. There we go. Um. I thought that was right. To be honest. We press it again. Oh, I hope this is not wrong again. Let's put this back here again. I'm confused. I am confused. Do we start again? What did we do wrong? We went through all four. Ah, oh, my brain hurts. Right. Let's start the process. Unless it's on the other side of that door. Let me really. So black. Okay, let's start the process again. Somebody leveled up. Who was that? Ash? Yeah, Ash is level 50 now. Okay. Let's kill these. Let's not go the secret way this time. Let's go the, the real way. Wasn't there any loot in his little hole, was there? There is loot in here. Oh, is the loot respawn? 56 gil. Let's actually just nip back down that, um... The hidden corridor, see if that loot is respawned. And this is loot is respawned as well. A Nishinjin belt. We're getting some good stuff in here, though. I must admit, the longer we stay in here, the better it's getting, right? Nishinjin belt. 
All right, you're right at the bottom. Yes. Uh, immune to sleep. It's not amazing. Don't be wrong, but I do. So there's actually a really good weapon here called the Dragon Whisker. Has that respawned? We've been in, like three different areas since, so it might have respawned. Nice, no, the one chest that hasn't respawned, eh? So you got the green one. Don't walk through the trap. Okay. It's potion, okay. So let's go the way that the, the normal way, not the hidden secret way. So then we come up here and we press the green one. There's four here, what's this one? Sigil of Sacrifice. Is there two Sigil of Sacrifices then? Redis is the only one hitting this guy. Oh, that's way too soon. Um, so you're the Sigil of Sacrifice. You're the Black Sigil. I thought you were the Sigil of Sacrifice, to be honest. You are, there's two Sigils of Sacrifice. Okay, we want green one. Green. Right. Okay, so by doing the secret way, we actually got the ultimate blade, didn't we? Okay, that's cool. So now what the red one? to here. And the next should be the Sigil of Sacrifice. There's a, oh, suddenly a yellow one. What's the yellow one from? You're dead. So I've got... Sigil of Sacrifice. Sigil of Sacrifice. Sigil of Sacrifice. Or Sigil of Sacrifice. I've got a feeling we did this, didn't we? So yellow was wealth. Purple was magic. Grey was steel. Grey was the last one we... Let's just try it. Screw it. Let's just see what happens. I'm a bit lost at the moment, to be honest with you. Please don't be in that... No! Um, if I don't move... I'll murder these people. Oh, I've got disease. Not disease, please. Anything but bloody disease. Disease is the worst. Alright, Bash and Pinello. Bim for Ash and Barn. Oh my god, disease again. Use my sleep of everything. Please release the door. Lost again, haven't we? Bloody lost again. This is fucking horrible, this area. It's so bad. Um. 
Phoenix down Pinello. Trap Phoenix down, you need to Gold Needle Pinello. Dragon steel on the door, that's just annoying as hell. I mean, how much more can Panello do to keep people alive? Release the door, please. We've been in here long enough, release the bloody door. How? Release the door! Thank you, right. Let me out of here. I just don't get it. We've done everything that it's said to do. Right, everyone get out. Right, up here. Back up here. In here. A little safe zone. Right. Problem is we're screwed now because of the disease. Right, I'm taking you with me. We're gonna go to my PC and I'm gonna have a look at the internet once again, right. I'm gonna read this to you. Let's put that on the map so I don't get killed, right. Right. There are two paths. The normal path. The first way stone uses black. It'll land you on a floor 81 where you press the green waystone. You're on floor 82, run to the end and use the red waystone. We did that. You're on floor 85, run to the end and use any portals here. With these last portals, it's a bit complicated matter. I've heard that you pick one of the colour of the altar you chose on the second ascent, but for me, each worked no matter what colour I did pick and I found my final destination. Well, you're freaking lying, mate, because I've been killed now every time I've I've used that twice, anyone, and it did not work whatsoever. Right, let's let's try another one, because this is a serious problem for us, I think. Right. Second. All right. Um. Right. Okay. See, that makes more sense. Hmm. Find that you gave up when you selected an altar or something. If you follow this guide and selected the altar of knowledge. Okay. Okay, I understand. Right, it was, it was. Right, I know what we're doing now. So we have to press the yellow one. You have to press the altar that coincides with what you gave up on the second ascent. Oh yeah, the red sigil is to transport you to the hidden area. Contains an ultimus blade. That's what we wanted. White robes. Ar Ardor's magic. Okay. One of the most powerful fire elemental magics in the game. Flare is also a magical spell. Okay, so we're actually learning magic. That's what those two things were. Right. Right, first is first. Let's... We're, we're really struggling. We have to get, um, well, we need to get to a save crystal as soon as we can. Right, let's get everyone raised and heal lots of stuff. We do have serums, okay. Not the end of the world then, is it? Um, let's put Ash back away. Bring Varn out. Right. I'm taking you back to the sofa with me now. So get ready. We're moving. We're on the move. Right. So. I know what we're doing now. I sort of knew that and I just didn't figure out which one it was. So it looks like on the second ascent we obviously only found the first thing. We've run out of serums for Van. Okay, so Van, you're going to have to stay in there until we find some else. Right. So first of all is black. Okay, we know that now. So this all to do with the previous what you've done through the dungeon, isn't it? Right, so let's 
Let's just speed this now. Alright, speed this as well. See if the treasures respawned. It'd be nice to get, um... I don't think it has respawned. Wow, look how many bombs there are here. This is how you chain, this is. That wasn't good, though. That self-destruct was, uh, not very helpful, was it? Where is treasures respawned? Another expo. It's a good way of just like getting more and more explosions, I suppose, by getting it wrong over and over again. Uh, let's just. Oh, these just respawned as well. Six, seven, get it. It's just the one that we want that doesn't respawn, does it? Or is there a random chance? Right, this is. Um, I know there's a trap in the middle of the room, but it doesn't seem to be showing up. Go. I just said about that trap, didn't I? Oh, I've got some worm fire shot, okay. Right, let's go let's go the hidden way, let's go the secret way. We know what the um what the combination is now. So after green it's red. After red it's yellow. So the guy on the previous one was saying, oh just press whatever you want, it'll all work in the end, doesn't matter. He was obviously lying. Dragon Helm, nice. So, red. Yep, red sigil. Takes us to the next area. Which is this one? There should be a yellow one here. There's a, yes, there's a yellow one. Okay, so we need to use the yellow one next then. And that should hopefully take us to the next area then. Without us being murdered by a load of roughs. Right. Yellow. Touch the device. Thing is, I think that we lost some of these magic spells, have we? Right, we're in the right place. Right, let me just have a quick look then. Equip. It's not equip, is it? It's, um... Inventory. Is that? No, it's not that, isn't it? Um... How do I see what magic we've got? It's not there, is this? Not any inventory at all then, no loot. Abilities, there we go, isn't it? Okay. So we should have... These in the order we got them? Ardor, we do have Ardor and we do have Flare, okay. So Flare, deal massive damage to one foe. Fire damage to all foes in range. License needed magics. So I think that's actually really good. I mean, saying only Fran can use it at the moment, but is that right? Ash can use that? I thought it was a black mage to be able to use that. It looks quite, you know, but evidently not. Um, it's got black magic and a bit of, that's it really, you just got black magic, okay. It's actually Fran who has the accessibility to Ardor as part of Arcane Magic. Um, which is that one? Arcane Magic. There we go. Ardor. Okay. It's a fire attack. Let's go Gambits. Fran. Weak to fire. Use... Ador. Where is it? Alphabetic order. Where is Ador then? Very good by Toxify. Slow, slow, just stop going by disable. Ah, it's on this side, okay. You'll massive fire damage to all foes in rain. Reduce one foe to zero. Darkra, dark Darkra. We'll put it on. Like some sort of super crazy attack, right? Let's read this now. We're on a different area now. We need to get to a save pillar as soon as we can. You reach this final sphere through these great gulfs of space. 
The undying the final path belongs. Pure brilliance unseen in distance traversed, untamed by glyph and colour. Right, please, just I want to save Crystal somewhere. <laughs> Dark crystal. I tell you what, I can't wait to get to um, more, more bloody crystals. Um. Nope. Redis has been diseased. We're gonna kill these things. We're just gonna. I think that's the problem. Do we get in the same order by any chance? What are you? You're white. You're steel. Or do I just continue on? Do I press buttons? I, I might just walk, I think. That's the way I came, isn't it? Um, there's bound to be another secret way down here. There normally is. Yep, there we go. Fools for card. So I think it's going to be the white one we have to press then because it's hidden away in here, which is good. But first of all, let's check for any more treasure. There is none. Okay. Let's press this one. freaking lift oh my god it's the freaking lift i'm so happy right now we're currently at 88 we want to go to 90 please be a save crystal at the end of this that's the only thing i want in life right now is a save crystal can't believe we just found the lift so down those little falls facades is generally the right direction to go it generally sort of tells you which way you're going Good. That yellow ball that just attacked us from behind. It's gonna hit the lifts. Okay, is this a big open area? Please don't tell me this is straight into a boss battle. Please, oh my god, it is. Straight into a boss battle. Please don't be a difficult one. I mean, we're struggling for help here. We're just done this massive damage through. It's not too bad. It's not great, actually, but... Hmm. How are we doing? Who is it? Hash I've heard of Ashmal. As well. He must be another... Um famous Final Fantasy boss, one who appears in a lot of different games. Right, can we use a... a Bacchus Wine on Redis? We can go berserk. And just start swinging for the hills. I'm going to take out Fran and bring in Bash. Just for the extra damage now. Although, a Redis is one with a disease. He's just been raised again, hasn't he? Right, can we, um... Can we then give... The Bacchus Wine to Bash? Ash has been diseased as well. There we go. Bash has been diseased now. He's doing some good damage. Ash has been diseased. I fucking hate disease so much. It's literally the worst thing on the game. Because you can't see the buy serums anywhere. Okay, you've done a special move. I don't like it. I'm normally only. It's not a um, an Esper, is it? 
Normally only Espers get these special moves. Uh. Right, can we bring in right, Van? You've got it as well. Let's bring in Fran for <laughs> Ashton. You know what his weaknesses are? No, we know he's protected. Um, Ran, can you use a dispel moat on him to unprotect him? So he's no longer protected. Um, Rank 3 quickening, rend the void damage on one foe. Okay. So assuming number 3 does more damage, I'm going to hold off for a moment, see how low we can get his health first. That's a big hit that was by Bash. 5,000 damage, 6,000 damage. Another 5,000 damage. Bash is looking pretty good now with this weapon. Right, I'm going to get his health down a bit lower. Now... Now let's hit the mist quickening. Let's go for the three star quickening chain. There we go. So we don't have control of Bash still because he's got the Bacchus wine. So it's got the two of these ladies doing it then. Okay. Makes sense. Right. What are we going to get? Let's get a little Pinello one on the go. These, I don't think these quickenings actually do as much damage as um as their actual weapons do now, to be honest. I don't know if they're actually good. I don't know if you are watching, these quickenings are actually good. Or they're just doing as much damage as what I would do normally with a weapon. Because I don't the best thing about them is the fact that you don't take any damage while doing them, which is nice. Nice, I've charged them both back up again. Nice bit of luck. I mean, I would expect this to kill him now. With the got a six chain, seven chain coming up. Here goes. Straight into another one. Another to charge. Yeah, feral strike from Fran. Nine chain. Ah! Boom. Any more for any more? Ah! Oh, time didn't quite enough time to do it, but that's not bad. Not bad. We're gonna get the cataclysm as well. No, the torrents. This should kill him. He didn't have much health left. If this doesn't kill him, it shows how weak these attacks are. I mean, we got 11 chain there, or 10 chain. Only did 19,000 damage. Literally, Bash spinning his axe, throwing his axe three times would have been enough to do that. Is that, an, that was an Esper as well. Wow. Okay. I did say that only Espers have got those sort of things, didn't I? Nice. We're picking up these espers now. It's got to be a save crystal now then, surely. It's got to be a save crystal after that. You obtain the esper Hashmara, bringer of order. Hmm, bringer of order, who would that suit best? We'll have to have a look through the license board, actually. See who gets the best rewards for it. Oh, cutscene. We're going to run a bit over this episode, aren't we? What's going on? Okay. Please. Please let me save the game. Please. Let there be a save crystal. 
We're going to end it there anyway because we're right... Well, we're way overdue anyway. So we'll end it there. And we'll come back next time. Some more Final Fantasy. And we'll continue on hopefully find a save crystal. And see where the bloody hell we're going. I've been Shabby. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye. Play my game, the one, two, two.